So this tutorial is on how to get a console plot. This is regardless of 1D, 2D, 3D, etc. I'm going to also go through some basic features of the plot so you can just find things. This is true for 1D, 2D, 3D, and just to look for these. Um, so first thing is this units. So I'm looking at case study 2, and the default is Kelvin. So if I select Kelvin and I select plot, I can see the units are in Kelvin, or I can do degree C, and that's that. If I want to change the title, it comes right here, manual, and you can enter whatever title, so your problem, and notice how it doesn't show up, so I'm just going to click, click plot, and it shows up. If I want to change the range, I change it there. Coloring style, I can go from rainbow, We can let's do disco. That's fabulous. Let's keep that. And then you see all these others. Resolution, smoothing, don't worry about. Recover, don't worry about. Don't worry about any of those. If I want to add in a label, which you're going to need for your homework, I just select it right here. So I go to this plot group, Y label. You just type it in there. If whatever you're looking for, it's likely there. I can also change the title here. Same thing. Plot. Bam. Wonderful. Color legend. I could tell it where to go. So that's how I edit my plot, and that's true for all the plots. So let me put in uh, radial and z direction. I'm not really picky. Okay, so I have a title. I have a y axis and x axis, which is what you need for your homework. I have a legend, which you have to have. So now I want the plot. You can either print your screen and paste it. Or you can do one of two things. So I want this picture. And so what I do is I click this image snapshot. So I left click that. And so you can tell it what to keep. You can change the font size, the pixels, etc. So if I do this clipboard, what happens is I click OK. No file is generated. But what it does is it's in your it's like hitting control C with that picture. So now if I do a right click, control paste in Word, there's my picture. Bam! Wonderful. Notice how it didn't have the title because I didn't select it. But let's say I want the file actually. So I can come back to this image snapshot and I can do file. I could say it was a PNG. Probably don't want that title. Don't ask. Um, I just click OK. And I should have wherever it is my wart right here. I have a picture of warp. Wonderful. And that is how you edit pictures for x-axis, y-axis title, how you get it on a clipboard, or how you actually make the file.